I believe that locals used to call it Murder Avenue. Not anymore. Artists and young people now live on Franklin Avenue in Crown Heights, Brooklyn. This um, very site where the bar is used to be a drug den. Real estate developers moved in and big changes began. Rising rents have forced out African-American residents and threatens newcomers. My landlord is speaking to me about increasing it, and I'm really nervous about how dramatic the increase might be. You guys studios, organic supermarkets, bars and restaurants replace longtime neighborhood businesses that cater to African-Americans. For example, barbershops vanished. Those barbershops are catered to, you know, dealing with a certain population, and once those populations are priced out, they leave. In a neighborhood that was once known to having churches on its every corner, the St. Ignatius Catholic Church was raised on Good Friday of 2014 to be replaced with 165 residential apartments. Skyrocketing values also affect existing homes in the neighborhood. 17 years ago, this house sold for $140,000. Today, it's listed for $975,000. <laughs> Meanwhile, Franklin Park Bar successfully established reading series. They are planning the next series of events. Franklin Park hosts um, a live music night, Brooklyn Up, um, which showcases local musicians. Reporting from Brooklyn, this is Solma Sharif.